which is why we should be focusing on our brain and our mind. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be about stress. And I have four different types of stress we're going to talk about. So let's get into it. Oh, and we're doing it a little different with my makeup because we are just going to focus on my eyeshadow. So the definition of stress is a feeling of emotional or physical tension, a state of feeling overwhelmed, or you being frustrated, nervous, or anxious. Looks even to me. So we're going to go for it. I have wrote down four types of stress. And when you look into stress, they have a lot named like they go over so many different types of stress anxiety but I want to talk about these four because these four popped up the most number one is time stress number two is anticipatory stress number three is situational and number four is encounter stress we will go over each one and talk about how to cope with them okay so the first one time stress it is worrying about time or the lack of and the things you have to do which leads to a feeling of failure like a failure within your achievements so if you're someone who gets stressed out over doing things in a timely manner this is definitely going to be you feeling like you're running out of time or you don't have enough time and to cope with this one you need to prioritize your tasks break up your projects into smaller sections don't overcommit to anything and do something you enjoy doing every day which goes hand in hand with setting a time leisure time for yourself the second one is anticipatory stress which is concerns and worries about your future thinking something will go wrong all the time and usually occurs around a specific event or when you have to meet with someone or when you have an unpleasant conversation with someone and when you have to meet with someone and those feelings start to arise and how to cope with that one is you have to do deep breathing exercises guided meditation journal writing and learning to visualize things that calm you down that way it kind of centers you number three is situational so that would occur when you think you have to solve this problem right now so it's also known as acute stress and how you cope with that one is you have to be realistic about situations and your solutions and kind of remind yourself deep breathing again and you have to reenact or you should try to reenact different scenarios maybe grab a friend or your spouse or a family member to help kind of maybe put you in that mindset and kind of prepare you a little bit which I thought was different definitely unique and number four the last one is encounter stress and this is defined as it comes from having to be in constant on mode where you have to be on at all times or being in constant contact with certain individuals and how you cope with this one is you have to prioritize your tasks deep breathing again and make time for yourself and learn how to wind down so let's take these off Not bad, they look mostly even. <laughs> okay, so let me finish my face off camera and then I'll be right back. And our fun fact is that we can be addicted to stress, which I didn't even know that was a thing. Stress causes a natural high and once your brain gets used to that and develops a tolerance for it, your brain will seek out more of that feel-good chemical. Crazy. Okay, everything is 
is finished. Okay, so we left off at feel good chemical. So, which means after time, if your brain is used to that stress and trying to chase that feel good chemical, your brain cells will lower and over time your brain can end up shrinking. It's crazy. I wanna do more research in this because obviously I am not an expert. I don't have a degree in psychology, anatomy, none of it. But I find it very intriguing, very interesting, which is why we should be focusing on our brain and our mental well being. Everything starts with our brain. So I hope you like this video. And again, I will link below other YouTube channels um, for breathing exercises. And I will try to link as much stuff as I can find. And if anybody else knows of any resources, please comment them. And another video, another discussion. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next week. Bye. A little bit different but I want to play around into my shadow today so that's what we're gonna do my channel my rules yeah I don't know what that was <laughs> this is the eye with all the extra wrinkles so gotta cover that up this brush is absolutely amazing we're gonna go old school because I don't have any elf eye tapes so here we go so stress number one is time stress number two oh no tragic okay okay anticipatory wow so i was gonna say it right good to know <laughs> Getting to play in makeup is literally like my favorite thing. Besides roller skating. Like if I had to pick a hobby to do by myself, it would be makeup or roller skating. I'm getting comfortable on my own. Loving me like an handle. So if I'm gonna love someone. That's terrible. That's terrible. <laughs> I cannot sing. And how you cope with this one is you have to prioritize your tasks. <coughs> what is going on with my throat? <coughs> Which goes hand in hand. <laughs> no. Okay, I'm gonna start filming. I love this color. Oh wait, what was I talking about? Which is why I've been trying to say everything starts with the brain. Oh no, I don't like the way I worded that. Oh, <sighs> if I can't get this last sentence, what is happening? Ta-da! Okay. I hit the towel. Try again, Willie. Don't forget. Oh, I sucked my tea. All I have to say is who is she? Because she cute. Oh, thumbnail. Bye, Yum.